Hey guys, welcome to another Gage and Gadgets Mixer.com tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to stream to Mixer using OBS. OBS is free open source software, so it's safe and it costs you nothing. And if at this point you already have OBS installed, you're just trying to figure out how to get it connected to Mixer, go ahead and skip forward a couple minutes because I'm going to go through the setup for anybody who doesn't have that information. To get started downloading it, go to obsproject.com and check the description for all the links that I talk about in this video. I'll have a detailed write-up down there. So we're going to go to obsproject.com. I'll be downloading the Windows version because I have Windows 10. Once it's completed downloading, go ahead and open it up. First we hit Next. We'll use the default save location. Up here, one of the important parts of this installation is for the Choose Components. Make sure you have all of these plugins installed because that will allow you to include more in your stream, such as webcams or maybe even the green screen effect, things like that. So you want to have as much of that as possible. Hit Install. Finally, when it's done installing, just select Launch OBS and click Finish. So now that OBS is open, we want to use the Auto Configuration Wizard. Now if you've closed that like I just did, you can always find it up in the tools right here. Select Auto Configuration Wizard. So we're going to use Optimize for Streaming. Select Next. This section is up to you. I'm going to use the default. Now we're going to select the streaming service right here. Go down and select Mixer.com FTL. That's going to allow for the least delayed stream. Now we need to get something called a stream key. So we're going to go back to Mixer.com. We're going to select the avatar up here so that we open up the little menu and go to Manage Channel. In Manage Channel, we're going to go to Stream Setup. Go ahead and select OBS. So now right here, we have the best server for our streaming, which is the Washington DC. And then we have our stream key. So you want to copy this, go back to OBS, and then in Stream Key, Go ahead and paste that. Select next. Select yes on the stream warning. And now it's going to do a bandwidth test. And as you saw for me, it only took a couple seconds. So go ahead and hit apply settings. So now OBS is set up to stream to Mixer live. So now let's go into how to create scenes in OBS. As you can see, we have scenes and sources right here. Scenes are groups of sources. So you add different sources such as a webcam or even gameplay. And you combine those in and create a scene. So in this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to display your screen or your game with a webcam in the corner. We're going to add the source for the game and the source for the webcam and then combine them together and then stream that to Mixer live. All right, to get started, we need to go down to the sources right here and hit the plus symbol. I'm going to go to display capture. You would go to game capture. In display capture, I'll just press OK. Right here, you select the monitors you want to stream. I'll be just streaming this monitor right here, so I'll leave that right there. Now, as you can see, the video of my display has been added to the stream right here. Next, we go to the plus symbol right here. And for the webcam, we go to video capture device. Now, I'm currently using a webcam that is plugged into my computer. So that means I have to use the webcam built into my laptop. I'll just go down and select that. It's not going to look as high quality or be positioned correctly. Select OK for your webcam. Now we have this very large webcam image. We can move that down to the right hand corner, which is where I like to have the webcam. Then we can drag the corner right here. And that's going to make the webcam smaller so that there's more gameplay displayed on your stream. So now basically we're ready to go. We have our stream set up. Now if you wanted to add alerts or things like that, check the link in the description. I have a playlist for how to do all those different things. But right now we can just start streaming by going down to the bottom right and selecting start streaming. When I go to my channel page, as you can see, this is live streaming. It's creating this mirrored effect right here, but we're streaming live to Mixer via OBS. To stop our stream, just go back to OBS and select stop stream with the same button. And as you can see, we're now offline. So that's how you start a Mixer.com stream using OBS. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more streaming or Mixer tutorials, check the link in the description. I'll have those down there. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up. And please consider subscribing to my channel, Engaging Gadgets, more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.